Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I have a makeup geek tomorrow. My last video, I told you guys that my sister was getting married. I'm the maid of honor and the makeup artist. The wedding is going to be in Sua. I'm just trying to get my things ready. You're going to have a vlog. A wedding vlog is coming up. Traditional weddings are usually done in the village, but when families have moved from the village, the wedding is taken to where the family members are. In this case, we are doing it in the city. <laughs> The women in the compound are jubilating, taking care of item 11, the food section, making sure everything is ready. While this is happening, the men are deliberating on the bride price. Did the groom check everything on his list just to make sure they that come to an agreement? Oh, while we're talking about Cameroonian traditional weddings, can I just sell my market as the maid of honor and the makeup artist? <laughs> there I am. This is the look I did on my bride. First of all, we tried the rouge lips, then we decided to add a little bit of pink to it, and this is what it looks if like. If you want me to do your makeup for your wedding, just like this one, or any other event you're attending, reach out to my work page on Instagram or on Facebook at red dot aesthetic as you just write to me or reply and they will just fix a date sharp sharp and that is come it. and pay me money thank you very much god bless you Now, once the bride gets into her room and is getting dressed, she doesn't go out until the in-laws are around and introductions are made. Food has been served, guests are arriving. This is about to be a great party. The bride is already dressed already and they're doing her photo shoot, so I have to go dress now. I tried doing some makeup a little bit. Nina is such a happy bride from day one. You can see genuine love in her eyes and excitement. She cannot wait for her day. She cannot wait to be Mrs. And I'm just so happy for her. I wish to be here today. Just to Palm wine has a huge significance in our Cameroonian culture. It's a binding agent in our traditional contracts like marriage or any other form of agreement. Cutting the head of palm wine or opening a cake of palm wine to present to your visitors first tells your visitors you're welcome to this place. Feel at home. We can talk together. We can reason together. <laughs> and I just think that the common image in the solidarity. Lumi and Lowe. Hello. Hello. Hi. Today for inside the meeting today, and Lumi are. Me for day one job. Some of you drink the Lumi and Lowe. Maybe when time goes, she say, "Me go run sweet, man go laugh up and down." So maybe tell them go go sweet, but they know why. So would they will look me? I look you. You should see, be don't come with some some around some nectar. You want test the flavor of that nectar because if be not test nectar, you know the be fine. But that one I want chop. No, so we go be nectar. So we don't come here. Because we don't smell some fine nectar. We don't want to like be where they come and never ask permission. We say, "Mo, come here, see your face." 
Yes. Ah, that was gonna find one. One crown to plenty. Depend as you don't count. I don't like Facebook. I'm only one thirteen girls. And we girls, the wrong one, girls, 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 girls. So they go start come up for you, you tell me which one you see her. But that small, small young one, they didn't plenty. So I don't know what and which one you know see her. So much more outside. <laughs> So what happens here is that the auntie of the bride goes into the compound, veils some girls, brings them into the living room, and the groom's uncle is supposed to pick the right bride. If they pick the wrong girl, they pay a fine. And generally, the aunties make money out of this whole procedure, since men are not directly concerned with money during the bride price agreement and the whole traditional wedding. <laughs> The groom's uncle picked the wrong bride. He has to pay a fine. The ladies are happy because they're going to chop his money. The aunties will bring about four or five girls in before bringing the bride and the uncles have to detect if any of those ladies are the bride. The hustle continues. It's time for the bride to bring her husband in front of her uncle so that the uncle sees the husband. She takes the wine from her uncle as a sign of consent, goes out, looks for her husband, brings him in, presents to her uncle and it's a deal. Once the husband drinks the wine in front of the uncle, their union has been sealed forever. We smile now. They joy where is they in we at. I know oh, by the way, the bride sold her dress. In fact, she made the address. I cannot wait to show you what she sold for the silver wedding. Like, she's such an excellent tailor. And this right here is just some of the things that were given for the bride price, being packed and carried to their permanent location. We ate, we drank, I didn't film. But thank you for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.